little hedgehog picture holder. For this project, you'll need a paperback book with some pretty good binding because we're actually going to leave all the pages intact for this one. I also recommend having a book that's less than 100 pages for this project. You'll need a pencil, scissors, patience, and if you want to decorate with some googly eyes, you'll need those as well. Let's get started. So you open your book to your first page. And all of these pages are going to be folded in the same way, so you get to decide if you want to fold towards you or away from you. I found that it was easiest to fold away from me. And we fold in half. And then one corner down. And the other corner down. Your corners don't have to be exactly next to the binding, they just have to be kind of close and then you'll want to do them all the same way. So again, that's folding in half. Folding your corner. your other corner. We'll do a couple more here. of the pages folded you might find it helpful to have a binder clip or paper clip to hold these together as you continue working through your book. As you can see with this one we're almost finished. I've got a few more pages and at this point I found it helpful to fold a couple of the half pages at a time. Again, I'm folding away from me on this one. So I'll do a couple of them. Fold half. page and then turn the book towards me so that I can make those end folds. folded in our hedgehog shape. Then you're going to take your pencil and lightly outline the edging on both sides of that cover. And to take your scissors and carefully cut along where you traced. secure and he is ready to get some googly eyes if you want or to hold all of your pictures. <laughs> 